Welcome to The Daily Dose, I'm Mike, your pharmacist. If you're interested in taking control of your health and expanding your knowledge, subscribe to the channel for more health topics like this one. Today, we are going to discuss how selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or SSRIs, work. SSRIs are considered first-line treatment for depression, obsessive-compulsive disorder, anxiety, and a variety of other conditions. They are some of the most commonly prescribed medications in North America. So how do these medications work? The short answer is they increase the level of serotonin in your brain. While there are numerous causes that can lead to depression, including environmental factors, it is believed that a depletion in serotonin is a major contributing factor. Serotonin is responsible for regulating sleep, wakefulness, appetite, and overall mood. A depletion in serotonin can cause major depressive disorder or anxiety. So let's go into more detail into the effects of serotonin. Our brain is made out of neurons. At the end of these neurons are synapses that communicate to each other via neurotransmitters. Now serotonin is a neurotransmitter. There is a presynaptic cleft which delivers the message and a postsynaptic cleft which receives that message. In between the pre and the postsynaptic cleft is the synapse. Extra neurotransmitters float around in the synapse waiting to either be sent to the postsynaptic cleft or to be recycled back to the presynaptic neuron via serotonin reuptake transporters. Now when serotonin binds to the postsynaptic cleft, it has positive effects on mood, but it can also be recycled back to the presynaptic neuron if the postsynaptic receptors are saturated or full. It is believed that someone who suffers from depression or anxiety has low levels of serotonin floating around in the synapse, leading to a depressive state. One way to amplify this effect of serotonin is to stop the reuptake or the recycling of serotonin so that more serotonin remains in the synapse and can bind to the postsynaptic cleft receptors. And that is essentially how selective serotonin inhibitors work. They block serotonin reuptake in the presynaptic neuron so that more serotonin can stay in the synapse and bind to the postsynaptic receptor and in doing so improving mood, appetite, and sleep patterns. Thank you for watching today. I'm Mike, your pharmacist. If you want to understand your health, hit the subscribe button below or leave me a like.